Good morning, beautiful, beautiful people. Uh, it's a beautiful Tuesday uh, morning here in Austin, Texas. Uh, once again, I'm on the Walnut Creek hike and bike trail, uh, out and about, um, getting these miles in. Uh, just a walk, hiking. Um, the idea is to hopefully get about another 12 miles, just to, uh, you know, get the get the, the 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 blood pumping, get the miles in, and things of the sort. Um, I've got about a little bit over 400 miles for the rest of the year to get to 3,500. So um, I'm, I'm, I'm taking the time to put these miles in. Um, now what I, I am learning though is I have to adjust. Um, after the last run, um, I was having a little issue with my knees and um, I'm 46 now. So I have as, as, as much as I can do, I still have to be smart and diligent about what I'm doing. So. Um, I'm pulling back on a lot of the runs. I still will get some runs in, but really just right now, just getting the miles in for the rest of the year. Um, at the beginning of the year, I've been talking about doing true marathon training, like switching it up, getting back into the gym, working on sprints, interval training and all that stuff. So, you know, uh, just to, you know, just to preserve, preserve my legs, my knees, my hips, all that good stats, my ankles. Um, today, I just want to talk a little, really, really quickly. Um, I talked about this in a video before, but uh, there's a gentleman that I met a few a couple months ago named Matt Lacey. Um, actually, I met him. I was in a restaurant here in Austin called uh, Vivo's, and I was eating alone. And uh, this good gentleman and his partner, um, both he and her, paid for my meal um, that day without me even knowing. And uh, he just said he just saw something and just wanted to reach out. So I just thought it was really, really cool. Uh, he was the gentleman that actually suggested I um, do the Shiner Beer Run, which was my marathon yeah. last week. And so I got to run with him and his running group and things of the sort. And it was really, really amazing experience. Really cool, like just life altering, honestly, for me. Um, and uh, one of the things we talked about was doing a Ragnar race. And that's been something that has been kind of formulating in my mind you know I've, I've been talking about the marathons i've been talking about the ultra marathons and the ragnar race is like a team race of six to eight people doing about 125 miles and switching it up and it's been something that i've been secretly like man i would love to have a team to do that how does that work well i think i found my team and as you can see from the picture um, with this post and uh, I'm extremely ecstatic about it. I'm really excited about it because it's just a bunch about community and getting to know people and uh, I'm thankful and uh, blessed. So uh, anyway, I'm gonna keep going, doing my thing. Have a great day. Be blessed today and every day. Thanks.